Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's having a great day. So guys, it's been a little bit of a while. Um, I have been very busy just working and I've also, I got rid of my cough so I can actually talk without coughing every single 30 seconds. So I'm happy about that. But in the last week or two, I've actually been very busy rearranging my filming area and my gaming area. So I wanted to show you what it looks like now. I filmed a little bit of what the empty space looked like, but I didn't talk you through it. But I will include that clip just so you know what it looks like before and then after. And I've been working on this for the last week and a half. I finally finished it today, um, the final touches, and I'm actually really, really happy with the way it looks. I will change things up um, every couple of months, the backdrop and stuff, but I'm really, really happy. Um, I've been filming in my bedroom for the last almost three years and it's been it's it's very tight with the tripods and everything like that in my room with my bed just trying to walk through everything especially at night time when it's dark I, I constantly keep my um tripods um and knock over the lights so I'm happy that I've got more room in my bedroom and also I'm really really happy with the backdrop and stuff like that um before I was just filming against a wall behind me so I didn't really have much room for a backdrop because there was just no room for the bed in front of it and then a walkway and then the filming area Anyway, I've been talking a lot. I'm just excited about it. And this is going to be a very short video, but I just want to kind of talk you through everything that I've done um, and kind of explain why everything's the way it is. It's kind of self-explanatory, but I just feel like I need to do a video. And I'm just proud of it. All right, so let me um show you. I'll flip the camera around and I'll show you what it looks like. I will include the um clip in um of what it looked like before. Then I'll show you what it looks like now. All right, let's do that. All right, guys, so this is what the space looks like now. Now, this is my dining area. This is my kitchen, very, very messy. I just got home and unloaded a whole lot of things. But this is my dining area. Obviously, I don't have a dining table, so I just thought I would use this space. Um, this is what it looks like when you walk up to it. I've got my ring light and my box light. These are the ones that I would always kick in the middle of the night. Um, so I'm glad I, I can finally move around without kicking and everything. I've got my trolley here with my extra brushes, my makeup tray that I need to clean, paper towels, tissues. We've got another box for brushes. I do keep my um, brushes in boxes just because I don't like the dust all over them and the cat hair because I do have a cat. But this is what it looks like when you look um, when I'm sitting down. So you've got the kitchen in the background, but this is what everything is. Now guys, this little trolley actually has my like everyday makeup that I want to have and reach for so if we've got a whole lot of palettes i do switch this up every couple of months we've got all my loose eyeshadows and some other bits and pieces we've got my face products um ofra benefit all of that color pop we've got these i bought these on amazon to try and do looks because a lot of people have been doing it on um instagram but i just couldn't seem to get it to work now this is one that i was working on before and it just wouldn't stay on so I've got to work out how to use them properly, but they're in there for now. We also have, this is just full of lashes and lash glue. Got a ton of lashes in there, as you can see. Oops. There we go. We have like my face gems and glitters and some chocolate, because you know, we all need energy. We've got more glitter and stuff like that. This is a face paint that I'm going to be doing a look with soon. And then we've just got miscellaneous and stuff. Miscel miscellaneous? You know what I mean. Sticky tape for presents, glasses. We've got my little um, wireless mouse for my laptop. This is what I do my Zoom calls on when I'm doing Zoom calls with people. We have other stuff, glue sticks, and then we've got face stuff. I don't know why toothbrushes are two pets in there, but it is. And then we've just got batteries and stuff if I need it for my controllers. <coughs> now, this is what's on my desk. I'm actually watching um, Ali's YouTube video right now. Ali Dawson, we've got my Xbox, TV, lights, ring lights, all that. We've got my mirror. This side, I think, is normal, and then the other side is five times. Setting sprays that I'm using all the time. My salad water if I'm doing cut crease. Q-tips in there. 
Um, so that's everything there. And then guys, we've got my backdrop. This is what it looks like. We'll start at the top. So we've got my Bling Brush X Ali Dawson um, PR box, glitter one. I've kept this nice and pristine and I wanted to always have it because I knew I wanted to do a backdrop eventually. Um, um, so I wanted to keep that and put it there eventually when I got the backdrop. This little thing keeps falling down. I want to like get some double-sided sticky tape and stick them on here. Um, but for now, I'm just trying to balance them there. So we've got a couple of, well, we've got quite a few little Pokemon like boxes um, with different cards. I'm actually going to keep all of these. Maybe they'll get better value-wise um, later on in a couple of years. So I'm keeping all of them for now. And I, I like the way they look for display purposes. We've got the Pokemon Go ones, which just came out. We've got another, so this is a smaller version, the Pokemon Go, then we've got the really big version. This is a lot thicker. We put the little shiny Eevee there. So we've got those. And then here we've got my Monster Cube box that um, keeps all my like favorite and valuable Pokemon cards, my PSA ones and stuff like that. We've actually got some PSA cards here on display. We've got a first edition Pikachu. We've got a Japanese Eevee, Charizard, these are PSA, PS10, PS10, PS9. Then we've got some more PS10. This is a first edition Polyworth hole, Poly. I don't know. I don't know what they're completely worth, um, but I did get quite a few of these at good prices. So we've got those. I do want to get like the individual case things. And my sister got these for my eyeshadows, to hold my eyeshadows, but I'm going to get the individual ones for these to hold. Then I'll use these for eyeshadows. And I'll probably put the eyeshadow ones here. This I just filled up because I didn't really have anything to put in. And I like the colors of all the sponges, my beauty blenders. It'd look a lot better if it was completely full, but it's quite bare. So I'm going to put palettes there eventually, but that's it for now. In here we have, my Pokemon stuff. So these cards I actually have to put in sleeves and put away. Um, and then we've got some other, you've just got extra sleeves here and stuff like that. So they're just extras and we've got a go bag here. And this one here, we've just got makeup and makeup products that I need to use. So we've got extra wet wipes and brushes. We've got some stuff that I want to do a video with, but I'm just waiting for foundations and concealers to be restocked at Kmart. So I'll do a, bench, do a video with those eventually. We've got a little Alakazam um, pop Pokemon one. We've got a full booster box of the Astro Radiance. Um, <coughs> sorry, um, booster box. I might do a video with those or I might just leave it or see. We've got another trainer thing, a tin. We've got a couple of tins here. These are actually um, holding all these extra things that I have and all the little tokens. So these tins are there. Um, and then we've got candles. I love candles, so we've got my candles there. Now in here, eventually I think I'm gonna put a whole lot of Pokemon stuff. I've got a lot of Pokemons in like container boxes or the extra cards. And I actually think I'm gonna empty this. There's still quite a few things in here. I wanna empty it all, put my Pokemon stuff in here. I might put some um, makeup stuff in here. And then on this side, I'll just put like stuff that I'm gonna put for giveaways. So anything extra that I've for giveaways in the future, I put in here so they're nice and um, secure. But yeah, that's my backdrop. I'm actually really, really happy with it. Let me just show you what it looks like from the camera's point of view. I'm really, really happy. Now, it is there is some dead space up there which I want to kind of fill um, with something in the background, so it's not completely like just you can see the wall. And then also with the beauty blender, like I said, it's a bit. Um, bear now on this side i was going to put some flowers or some like dead plant not dead plants the plastic plants on either side but what i might do is i might actually get some skinny shelves or something and put some more um pokemon related stuff on the side or makeup stuff either way um because it's just a little bear there but uh, that's that's what it looks like for now i'm really really happy with everything i'm not going to do too much with the backdrop in the next couple of weeks because i'm going to fiji in less than a week so when I come back, I'll work on this a bit more. Maybe I'll do another shelf up here and just have a bit more stuff there. Um, but yeah, this space, I want to put either a plant, like a, a green plant or something, or another little box shelf like this, but a very skinny one. And then I can maybe put some of these cards there and then fill this area up with my um, shadow palettes. That's what everything looks like. I'm happy with the space 
that I've created. Now this is what I use when I film my lives um, on TikTok or Instagram or YouTube. I just bring this out um, and sit it in front of here and then film. I'm actually happy that this actually has a spot in the corner so it's not just yeah, it's, it's out of the way, but it's easier to get to. And then we've got the bin there as well. So I'm really, really happy with everything. We've got my little ring light that I used to have behind me when I filmed. So there'll be some light against the wall, but I don't need to do that now that I've got a backdrop. So I'll just keep that ring light and I can use it for other things in the future. We've got my printers and stuff like that. I need to clean this space up a bit, but this is the best place for the ironing board right now. So I'm going to leave that there and tap away. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with everything. This took me a good three or four days to get everything done because I I wiped everything down. There is some dust on there now because I've been cleaning and stuff, but there is, I did wipe everything down before I put it, mopped all the floors, did all stuff like that. And I had to do some trial and errors space-wise. Um, I actually bought this from Kmart and I built this three or four days ago and put everything on it. Um, so I had to get one of those. I didn't have that in my house. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy with everything. So yeah, guys, that's um, what I've been doing for the last couple of weeks. I'm really, really happy um, and excited about being able to move a lot more and to film a lot more content for you guys. I do have some videos planned. I actually have a collection, a new makeup collection. Hopefully it arrives tomorrow. Um, it did say it's gonna arrive tomorrow, so I'm hoping it will because it has taken about seven weeks to come. I bought it last month, the start of last month, and the brand has actually released a brand new eyeshadow palette since then, so I could order the brand new one before I get the one that just got released two months ago, almost two months ago. So that's a little bit upsetting because the last time I ordered from it only took two weeks. I don't know why it's taken so long. I really wanted to get that video out for you guys because I really like the brand and I'm really excited about the eyeshadow palette and the lip glosses with it. But we, you know, it's shipping. I live in Australia. You can't, you can't, um, you know, complain too much. But I wanted to get that video out for you guys before I go to Fiji. If it doesn't come tomorrow or Friday, then I just won't be able to um, film until after I come back. I am going to try and vlog a bit of the Fiji trip and I do have a GoPro, so I'm going to try and snorkel with that as well and show you some fish and, and hopefully swim with a turtle that's my goal um but yeah i'm really excited about the trip um but i've got a lot to do before that i've got to put my cat in a little cattery place while he's away um my flatmate was going to look after him but that's not happening now so <laughs> i have to um look after i have to put him in that um which he probably won't like because he likes his he he's a cat of leisure and likes to go in and out whenever he wants and sleep whenever he wants. So, um, yeah, anyway, that's going to be two weeks for him that he's going to have to deal with. Um, and hopefully he'll appreciate me a lot more when he comes back home. <laughs> we'll hope. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited about the trip. I'm really happy about this space. I've been wanting to do this for such a long time, but it's been hard because I have a, I, I did have a flatmate who works night shift or works during the day, normal hours, Monday to Friday, and I work night shift. So when I am trying to keep my sleeping pattern up, I'm basically stuck in my room because I can't cook anything because it makes too much noise in the kitchen and he wakes up. So by 10 p.m., I'm basically stuck in my room. Um, but now that I live by myself, I can make as much noise and film whenever I want and play whenever I want on the Xbox and make as much noise as possible. So hopefully guys, my <laughs> filming schedule um, will become a lot more uh, reliable and I produce a lot more content for you, um, Pokemon and makeup wise. I do actually have a mystery box coming from the US from um, Bonnie and um, Tammy, which I'm really excited for because they included um, some stuff that I wanted from Ofra, which doesn't ship to Australia. So they managed to get that for me um, and ship it with their stuff that they were sending me anyway. So I'm really grateful for that. Um, and that will be here when I come back from BG. I can film that unboxing and hopefully play with the items that I got in that. It'll be all makeup related. So I'm really, really excited about that. All right, guys, with that, I'm going to go because I've got to clean. I want to clean my fridge out, my pantry out, um, wipe everything down and throw out a whole lot of stuff that's been there for ages, especially my flatmate or my ex-flatmate stuff. Oh, by the way, we left on good terms and stuff. I um, He got a job on the other side of the country, which I'm really excited for because, you know, he, he works very hard. So it's really good that he's getting that. Um, and it's quite a quite a cool experience 
There is someone outside my house right now and I don't know what they are doing. They are sitting in my garden. Anyway, um, I'm going to go and I will talk to you soon. Bye!